Hi, it is already March. So yeah, it's about time I put my February favorites up and out. So I have a few things that are brand new to me. Other things are tried and true, um, but let's, and it's all over the place item wise. So anyway, let's get started. Let's talk about February favorites. Okay, first of all, many of you know that I have been using my Instant Pot and just trying to learn just the ins and outs of it, what works best for me, what I'd rather just cook a different way, whatever. And I have been using it quite a bit lately. And the first thing that I noticed that I didn't like about it was that everything seemed to stick to the, the insert in it. And that just drove me bananas. And I thought, well, you know, why don't they, do they have one? Maybe they'll come up with one that is non-stick. Well, they did it and I found it and it's great. And you can get this, I, the link I put down below for all these things, by the way, um, there's a link for the three quart, the six quart and the eight quart. So whichever one you have, but it is a non-stick insert. And so I got this one. I've used it several times. Um, it works great. So it works. Everything works exactly the same as the other insert. It's just that it doesn't stick so much, which is just perfect. You don't have to add so much oil and things to try to keep things moving. So I really do like that and highly recommend it if you have an instant pot, because that makes things so much easier. Clean up everything. It's good. Love it. And speaking of instant pot and all the things I've been trying, I did find out sort of the hard way that that ring gasket thing that goes in the lid um, it tends to retain a bit of the smell of whatever you cooked last, no matter how long you clean it, no matter how long you soak it in baking soda water. I've tried it all, but you still seem to get like either a savory smell if the lot, those are, that's what you've been doing, or if you do desserts in there, it's more of a sweet cake-like thing. So then I learned that that's normal. It happens. People know about this and they sell these little two sets things of two different colors of the little gaskety, you know, rings. Uh, for the top for the lid and you can always remember let's say your red one is for savory and your blue one is for sweet and that way you can switch them back and forth so you're not adding some cake flavor to your chicken and vice versa so I thought this was a great idea I grabbed a set of these just got them the other day and I'm really excited about it because I found out that that's definitely necessary so those are definitely going to be one of my favorite things because I'm still trying to learn how to use my um, instant pot and I want to do the best I can so yeah um I always have to say all these items will be linked down below the best place I can find them um, not sponsored in any way shape or form so there you go all right now the other thing I didn't bring it up here shoot I also for the instant pot got the lid there's like a glass lid that you can get it doesn't come with it uh, and that's basically for when you're doing sauteing or have your keep warm function. You can have a lid on it without putting that big lid and you know, doo -doo 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 -doo. so you can just put the glass lid on like a crock pot or when you are doing your slow cook mode, you can just put the glass lid on and you can just see how it's going throughout the whole process. You don't have to put that big steamer lid on. You can use it as a crock pot with that big lid that comes with it, but you don't have to. You can get this extra lid if you want to. I did. Um, you can use it to like store leftovers if you want to stick them in the fridge or whatever, but I like it especially for if you're sauteing and things might be a little splattery, I'll put the lid on then. And if uh, you're slow cooking and you want to see, that works then too. Plus, if you have it on the keep warm and people are coming home different times of day and you want to just put a lid on it without having the whole big lid. So anyway, I use my hands a lot, don't I? <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I love that lid. Used it a bunch. Again, everything went below. So there's that. Okay, I didn't, I don't have it with me. I talked about it last favorites, which was the January favorites, the Barefoot Dreams sweater for dogs. I got one for Gracie. I got actually two and I had to decide, you know, which fit her best, but um, and I returned the smaller one. But I did get her a Barefoot Dreams vest for her birthday. And yeah, kind of crazy, but that's how it goes. And I'm telling you, it is so, so soft and so snuggly and you put that on your pupper and just to snuggle i mean my gosh she feels like the softest stuffed animal in the world you just want to hold her all day long in that thing Ugh, all february whenever she'd go anywhere she'd be wearing her pink sweater and she loves it it's just the coziest little snuggly thing and so here are some pictures of her with it and it's just the best they have different colors i talked about it in january i just had to say throughout february she has been wearing that and looking like a pink little fluffy princess I'm always using these kind of um, insulated type 
what are they called? Like tumblers basically for all my water. I drink a ton of water. I put like a half a lime and every time I fill it up, I cut a lime in half and I squeeze half the lime juice in there. Lemons if I have those, I'm drinking it all day long. And this sucker is huge. This is like 20 some ounces or something. I don't know. It's a big one. So I absolutely love it. I was looking recently though at these because I love this brand and I found the Yeti insulated. Now I've loved these all my life and I still do and I still use them. However, this does keep it cool even longer. Many times I have gotten it down to just the ice and maybe a little bit of water left or just there's ice left in there and just set it on the kitchen counter with the thing open and everything and gone to bed. And the next morning I wake up and I go and they, the ice still clinks around in there overnight. So it's just, it's just crazy. And I love that about it because seriously, you, I, I keep these in my car with me everywhere I go. I, I always bring my water with me in non-water bottles. You know what I mean? The, in the kind that you can refill. And so upset about all the water bottles in the world, you know, the throwaway kind. So I always make sure I have something for everyone in the family to take with them. If I see them with a water bottle in their hand, I get mad at them. So yeah, get yourself a really good one. These keep things hot for a very, very long time and they th keep things cold for even longer. And I love one, this one, it's the, um, this is called the Rambler. And it has this mag lid. It's like a magnet little back and forth thing and it. It's just real secure. I love it, but you know, it's just so easy to clean. I adore it. Many, many, many colors too. So this I got from a friend um, for Christmas and this is so wonderful. It's a wine glass. It's a 10 ouncer of Yeti. And so if you're having, which I love my wine to be cold pretty much. My, I usually have white wine and in the summertime, it's fantastic. I'm sure of it because it does keep it cold for such a long time and you can just sip on it lightly throughout some, you know, party or whatever and you're good to go it's always going to stay cold i love it so i got this <laughs> this little wine uh yeti also there are so many different types of tumblers coffee mugs so many things so i did link the entire site down below so you can take a look they have the best coolers in the world none of these things are inexpensive i mean it's it's kind of an investment but it is so good this is the only one you're going to want only one you're going to need and yeah just use this and don't use all the plastic please <laughs> the throw away so there's that speaking of that this is another thing here's another thing i'm really wanting to share dealing with environmental stuff gosh i feel like i'm a, just up here on a soapbox but again with the straws now places are not giving straws i personally if i'm going to get some sort of an iced tea somewhere i want a straw i don't know i like the straws so with the straws not being available or the paper ones that just give me the heebie-jeebies i don't like those either um i was looking for a reusable straw that i could take with me and i've shown several options and so forth but these here are even better for actually traveling with me the other ones i've shown i keep at home and use all the time but these are perfect for travel and i found two different options Options. One of them I think is hilarious because I love that what it's called. It's called the final straw. That's a final straw. So anyway, this is the final straw and it has this little thing you can attach to your phone, um, which is very handy. But what this one has is a stainless steel straw in this little container that fits in any bag, any pocket, any glove compartment, whatever. And you have, it just pops right open and you just pop out the straw. Just immediately just bloop comes right up to a straw. See, it just makes itself a straw. These are stainless steel. Yep, and this is a little silicone at the, to, you know, suck. So there's silicone in between these pieces and that's what folds it up, okay? So you can use your straw wherever you are, out and about, and then just kind of, you know, try to dry it up a little bit. And then you just fold it right back up again and you stick it in your little pouch and you are good to go. So I think that's fantastic and I love that it's called the final straw. And this was a uh, Shark Tank winner. If you ever you know, watch that show, it's kind of cool. Now this I saw before I found out about that and we, I've been using these, um, gave one to my daughters and so forth like that. And I think these are great too. If you really don't want the stainless steel or that type of a thing, this is a set of four. You get four of these if you just want to grab them for your kids, for your family, whatever. 
It's a set of four and they come in different color options. This set comes with two white, a mint and a pink. And they have these little like carabiner, you know, type of uh, clippies. So you can clip them on the edge of your backpack, whatever, your bag, you know, anywhere you can think to, to put it, belt loop, whatever. And it's just a simple little pop open, pop closed. It's just, it's just silicone. It's just right in there. You just pop it right out. And it's a little wibblier. It's not quite as stiff as the other, but see, it's not bad. And it's comfortable. You're not gonna hurt your teeth. I know some people are really kind of concerned about that sometimes when they use straws. And it's silicone. You can clean it. Collapsible, non-toxic, reusable, soft on teeth. I think these are great too. And I am happy about them for sure. So you, if you're going to the amusement park with your kids, whatever, and they don't give straws, you can just all have one of these. It's wonderful. It's just, I like a straw, but I don't want to like ruin the environment, you know? So, okay, now this next thing is interesting. This is something that I have been doing for probably the last two years or so. And I keep thinking I'm going to talk about it, and then I never do, and then I think I will, then I don't. But I just received a recent check from this company, so I thought, I'm going to throw this on there. If you've ever heard of Rakuten, I don't know how it's pronounced. Anyway, it's basically a cash back thing. And I have a little doohickey on the browser of my computer. It's really easy to set up. So anytime you go to a website, you're like, let's say you're going to Target and you want to shop for something at Target online. And it will show you that that is a Rakuten thing and you'll get a certain amount off if you just click right there. So you just do that anytime you're shopping online for anything. Okay. And stuff. So Sometimes they have, you know, an extra 5% off or whatever. They have these different things. So if you just go through your day and just the regular places you shop and you happen to see that, oh, that, you know, that has a coupon for it or whatever, and you get a certain percent off and you just click it. That's all you do. It doesn't cost you anything extra or whatever. Just click that and you will get a, a certain percent off your total. Easy, super, super easy to the point where it's like, you're not even hardly doing anything. After you set it up, you're done, whatever. And they just send you checks. <laughs> And I've been doing it for two years and it's been fantastic. This last one, I received $54.77. And I don't even, I mean, I didn't even do much, but that has been very helpful. I've made, you know, I mean, I, I'm happy to get an extra $54 a month for doing nothing extra. You know, I just, I just click on that little button. So I wanted to share that with you um, to find out more about it and easily sign up for it. There's a link down below, just click right there and it'll tell you everything you need to know and easy setup and so forth, it doesn't cost a thing. Um, it just saves you money. It's good, good stuff. So I just thought I'd mention that one because I love it, I use it, and I'm always excited to get that check at the end of the month. I have discovered recently, um, it's a brand that I've tried before in tops and things, but not the jeans. And I've tried the jeans recently and I really, really like them. They're the Not Your Daughter's Jeans jeans. The ones I fell in love with that I love the most are in the laundry right now, but I did want another color. So I grabbed these and I got this color, which is, what is it called again? Lombard, I think. Yes, Lombard. So they are not your daughter's jeans. They have this, I don't know, sculpting and lifting effect and they just, they just do really good things for your body. It's amazing without feeling like you're being sucked in and, you know, maneuvered. They're soft, they're stretchy, they feel like... Um, they kind of feel, if you look at this, they feel like leggings. I mean, you're, they're very, very comfortable. And I liked this color. So this is called Lombard. It just looks more worn. So like, they're like leggings kind of, you know, just your average jean. I'm really loving them. Very plain pocket, but everything is situated and made to sit on your rear end just right. So. I don't know. And they're comfortable. They wash well. They wear well. I needed another pair or I wanted another pair in a different color. And I think I'm going to be trying the white for spring. So there's that. And I, I linked two places down below that sell them. Check both of them out because sometimes there's sales. So either one of them is cheaper one place or the other, but generally speaking, this is where I go and, you know, get them done. Oh, and if you've signed up for the, the Rakuten thing, both of these places will give you some, some money off. <laughs> there's that. So I really am liking these. I think this is kind of a perfect mid color, especially for spring. I'm really excited about them. Really, really. Okay. Last but not least, do you remember, I think it was my June or July favorites. I was sitting outside doing my favorites and I was talking to you about the, um, perfumes by Skylar and 
I just love them. I love the fact that they're not toxic. They, they're cruelty free. Um, they're not going to be anything that you breathe in that's going to cause any kind of a problem because they're just fresh, clean, natural, wonderful, good, fresh scents. And I love that. And they're, they're not bad for you. So many perfumes just have so many awful things in them. So I love this company and I love this perfume. So my two favorite scents personally are Capri or Capri, however you pronounce it, and Coral. And Coral especially has been the one that I've been loving um, since the other is, was more summer, this was more fall and winter. So I've been using the heck out of the coral. And then soon after I made that video, they came out with body bundles of the different fragrances. You can get, it's a body wash and a lotion in whatever scent it is you're wanting. And you can just sort of, it's like you're layering and then you get more of the scent because they're light and fresh. Um, and you want to sort of add more layers to it, just make it even a bit more longer lasting or whatever. It's wonderful. So I just grabbed these out of my shower and my bathroom just now. And what I do is I use the body wash. I'm pretty far down on this one, I needed another one. Um, I use the body wash and it's, what's what I love about this is it's got hyaluronic acid in it, which will keep the moisture in. It's just wonderful, wonderful stuff. Let's see what it says. Uh, clean, hypoallergenic, cruelty-free, vegan, eco-friendly, dermatologist tested. Um, good, good stuff. So anyway, we have got a lot of really good ingredients in here. No parabens, no sulfates, no phthalates. Phthalate, phthalates, how do you say that? Do you really say foul? I don't know. Anyway, no phthalates and it's good. It's really good stuff. So I got it in the coral. Like I say, you can get in any of the fragrances that you like of, this, of the line. And it also comes as a bundle with the body lotion. So you shower, you use this amazing body wash. It's very nourishing. It's very, you just, it just feels so good and so moisturizing. And then the hyaluronic acid in it keeps your skin so moisturized, it kind of helps lock in that moisture. And then you go and use the body lotion on any part of you that you want to. And it also has a little bit of the hyaluronic acid in it, which does again, keep the moisture in. So it's perfect. And you get more of that scent. So you still have to, you have another little layer of that wonderful scent. And they describe coral as fruity, floral, and flirty. And that's my kind of scent. I like that a lot. So you just sort of add that together and then when you finish getting dressed or whenever you can spritz your body with the perfume. Oh. And it just lasts all day and you just feel fresh and fruity and floral and flirty or whatever they said. So I really like it. Again, it comes in all the different um, scents. So for this month's giveaway, I will be giving a set of the body bundle in coral away. I love it. I think it's something that's pretty universally nice. Um, most people would like this scent because it is just very, very natural, fruity, a uh, little bit um, floral and flirty. A brand new body wash and body lotion. Good, good stuff. If you're interested in looking at the line of products from Skylar that they have to offer, make sure you click down below where I've linked it and you can go straight to their site to look at all the other body products. They even have deodorant now. That's our newest thing is deodorant. How exciting. I think it's in two different scents, Isle and Capri. So those are the two for the deodorant, which I haven't tried yet and I'd like to try that too. But I love how now there's a whole basically a, a scent system and I love how it's all so clean so far so great so anyway again not sponsored just love them a little bit of giveaway information though for any of you who would like to enter this giveaway go under the video where it says show more click there and then you'll see all the different links for different items I've talked about and then below that you'll see click here to enter the giveaway and you just click on that and then you'll enter your email address and whatever question I've asked if you want to just put a little answer in there that's fun for me um, and that's how you enter and I will let the person who wins I will let them know via email because you'll be putting your email in there and I say exactly when that will be and what the requirements are and stuff down there. Um, I've had some people put in the comments their email and you know I don't think I don't know if that's the most safe thing to do so if you want to enter don't send me your email in the comments click down below okay and good luck because this is a good one I'm really excited for you to try it so yeah you're gonna love that one. So February went fast. It always does. We're into March. I'm excited to hear about what your favorite things and maybe least favorite things are about March. I believe that's my giveaway question. So answer those for me. It'll be fun. And yeah, thank you so much for joining. Oh, I got to stop saying yeah. I was told that. Um, yeah. Okay. <laughs> 
So thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. February went fast. We're now into March and uh, yeah, spring is, oh, I did it again. Okay, I'm so sorry to the lady that commented that I need to stop saying yeah all the time. I don't know if I can. I am trying so hard, okay? Cause I know that that kind of stuff can get annoying and I don't mean to. So I'm working on it, okay? I really, really, really am. But you're gonna have to give me a little bit of time to, you know, really get that going because it's not working so far. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. And I will see you really soon. Bye.